Hi, this is Ariane from La Fée de la Mer, and today I will show you how I make a perfect rainbow soap. First thing, uh, make sure your mold is leveled, because if it's not leveled, um, your soap won't be either, and you won't have a clean straight line. Let's go. Making a rainbow soap takes time and needs preparation. So here are all my colors that I've prepared in line in order which I want to put them. And then I have my basic uh, oil recipe here. It's at about 100 degrees. Um, I won't mix all the lye at once in this. I will proceed in six different batches to allow um, each color to set before I place the next one on top otherwise uh, it won't be even and I will pre-mix in this little stainless steel uh, pitcher which I like it's very uh, sturdy it's tough and um, easy to handle I'm only gonna do the the portioning part process once to show you how I do it and then I will simply show you how I pour the soaps afterwards. So, portioning out 1,333 grams. Based on my specific recipe, I am now adding my lye water solution. Okay. That you can see better. So I got my first color here, which is going to be red. And I have a little bit of a titanium dioxide, just in case some of the colors are uh, are too dark, so then I can light light them up a notch if I need to, to do so. Anyway. And you, you don't want to get to thick trace while doing this, otherwise you won't have a straight flat line between each color. So this is a red I like. Now I'm going to add my fragrance oil and back onto the scale because everything needs to be portioned out. I have my yuzu right now and I need 40 grams of this per color. Oops. So I will switch you over to the mold, remove my lever. And pour. Pour the soup evenly. There we go. And I don't like wasting anything, and I won't be making a swirly design on top. So, placing all of the soup. I'm trying to scrape out as much soap as I possibly can because I'm just gonna wipe this down with paper towel and then remix in the same container. Pretty clean.
Well, that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I will be back shortly with more soap making videos. And I will leave you with a couple close-up pictures of this rainbow soap. Take care. Bye-bye.